Howdy y'all, my name is Price, and welcome back to another episode of Mega Aquarium. So we're currently working on trying to get some more science going so we can get this Mega Chiller. And we're going to build a giant um, Belfast tank to sneak in right over here. I may have to wiggle a little bit with my space over here in order to make it work. I'm going to give us a little more space. And we're gonna... Like, I might have to move the pump into this zone. But, with as much money as we have, I should be able to go ahead and buy the tank to just start working with it, you know? God, it's big. <laughs> That's a real big tank. Um, wow. Wow, wow, wee, wow. But how much space does it have in it? 225. And it's going to be our big chiller. So it's like... the We will fill it with that wolf fish, with the turbos, with the um, Atlantic uh, Pollux. So we're fine. It's It's got reason. And we never made any corals. And I know I never make corals in this game. And I'm sorry if some of y'all out there wish I were making more corals. Honestly, can I pick this up and rotate it? Yeah, it's good, because it's going to go that way, actually. Um, so I apologize if that's something you were looking for. Yeah, it'll go right there. Because that's how it's going to be able to reach. So I might have to, like, increase a little bit of space there. But honestly, even like this, it'll be fine. People looking for a toilet. There's a toilet right there, you dink. Um, yeah. So it'll be like that. Yeah. Okay. We'll get another staff door over here to make it easier for access and all that kind of stuff. Maybe we'll put another toilet or whatever. You know, we'll, we'll do some stuff. Um, okay. And we just reached the next day, so that's good. Um, obviously, we're going to need a lot of... We need a lot of stuff for this. Did we ever get the... We never got the Ultra Mega Filter. That's fine. We're going to probably want two of these. Which just cost 900 a piece. It's fine. I'm really hoping we can unlock this mega chiller here in a second because that's gonna that is gonna significantly improve what we're able to do with this. Come on. There we go. This guy's coming. So I might go ahead and just put Oh wow, we're spending so much money. <laughs> I'm just looking at like uh, the amount of money that I've spent and then the amount that like we get per day is those margins are shifting closer and closer together. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, it's all good, it's all good. And the only reason I'm doing this is just preemptively. I'm putting down this large nitrate reactor for a couple reasons. One of which being we are waiting on our mega chiller. Um, but I do think that this will be the thing that puts us over the edge to getting these goals accomplished. Uh, God, man, you're bad at everything. <laughs> um, fix. Harry, I should fire you. Um... <laughs> It's, it's not that bad. It's just that his stats are so low that it, like he's just not as good at stuff as everyone else is. And we got an extra thousand bucks. I might... Yeah, this is going to be the needs center right here. Um, so I can go ahead and start getting some stuff. A fizzy drink machine. Um... Sure, feeding's fine. Let's get a couple of padded benches, you know. Let's um, let's get some bins here. Let's get a chocolate vending machine. Um, and we got fourteen fifty now in terms of monies. We're almost there with the big chiller. Come on, come on, almost there. Uh, let's get you some fixing skills. Yeah. How are these guys doing now? Now that I got rid of half of them. They're fine. Okay. Come on, thing. Ooh. Javier, the ultimate feeder. Or Xavier. I don't know how he pronounces it. Probably Javier. Pick next research. We're not going to get a chance to use the U-Tank, I wouldn't think. Popcorn could be nice. Mega double filter could be nice. 
Deluxe toilet could be nice. Let's get deluxe toilet, because I, I have a feeling that might add to prestige. Um, let's get mega chillers. We need two of these. Okay. Okay, I was about to be like, are you kidding me? That's not enough. It's way more than enough. Okay, and we got 600 bucks. What do we need for these boys? No rocks, no anything. They're wimps. No rocks, no anything. They're a danger to crustaceans and small fish. And what about the wolf fish? He needs caves. And he's a danger to crustaceans. So, are any of them a danger to starfish? Turbos might be. Turbos are rude. Yeah, friggin' turbos. That's fine. We've got all the starfish represented, so we're okay. How much space do we have in this tank, by the way? We have probably so much. Yeah, we have double the space in this tank. So if we can get some more big boys that are, um, that are warm water fish, that would be nice. And that won't be a danger to either of these two species. Are there any big, like, sea cow type fish? You know what I mean? Like things that aren't going to eat other fish. How about the moray eels? Would they work in here? So these guys count as size 16, so they're fine. These guys are size 8. What are you a danger to? Size 11. Dang. That's a real butt. Because once they get to full size, then they become a danger. Um, so no mores. No groupers. How about these tangs? We can get some tangs. They're size 6. French angelfish, what are you bad with? Corals? We can get some more French angelfish. They're, they got up to a good size. Por we can get some more porcupine fish. Spotted boxfish, you don't have those anywhere, do we? They just don't like to deal with other fish that eat cockles. Is anything in here eat cockles? No. Let's put the spotted boxfish in here. Man, this tank, the, the issue I'm going to have with this tank is that it's going to be... Um, a big tank full of small small fish, which is not necessarily a good thing. There we go. You want a big tank full of big fish, is what I've learned from playing this game. Small fish, small tank. Otherwise, you get too many things that need to be fed. Okay. So now we're just saving up to try and get the fish into here that need to go into here, right? Um, we're really close to hitting our numbers, which means once this tank goes out, we're pretty much set. So, let's start working on it. Um, let's start with the mackerels. Oh, we need to have a school of six. Wow. Well, wait a minute. I thought... I thought these were Pollux. We've had Pollux in the past. But luckily, we still shouldn't have any trouble, should we? Are the turbos going to eat them? Turbos are evil fish. They're evil, evil fish. Because if these guys are only size 8, then what I worry about is when the turbos get big, will they eat these fish? Because these guys grow big. Here's what this needs to say. This game, what I would love. Because this game, I, I love this game, but it does have this problem. And this is a problem that I've had the whole time I've been playing it. Which is... Um, when a fish grows, it doesn't tell you how, when it's big, when it's fully grown, how dangerous it is. It only tells you how dangerous they are when they're small. That doesn't help me plan around what my tanks are going to look like. But the Atlantic mackerel should be fine with the wolf fish that we're going to get, which is one. He gets up to size 33. Um, so we're definitely going to need some, um, some caves up in here. But you guys get what I'm saying? Like, it doesn't tell you how dangerous they are when they get larger, which causes me some stress. Okay. Wow, we might hit it. We might beat it here in just a second. What are we doing that's working? Do, 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 do. All right, let's get the wolf fish. What does he eat? Crab. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think we have those. <laughs> Um, that's fine though. Okay, now let's move it out here. Not like that though. Valid placement? Oh, because of the... Can't even do 
that. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We'll earn some more money in a second. Oh no! I've just realized the folly of my ways. Oh, pain in my butt. Pain in my butt. All right, y'all. So here's the issue. I had planned this whole thing around the concept that the pump would be right up against the wall, but I neglected to think about the fact that this will be taking up a spot there. We'll get it. I just need to get the money to um, expand out this area. Be a thousand bucks. It'll be fine. We'll get there. Ay -ay 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 -ay. How's the bullfish doing? Oh, he's going to die if I don't feed him soon. So <laughs> let's make sure we go ahead and get the um, feeder ready. Why do you do that? You knew what you needed to be. Why do you do this? Why is it doing that? See? Why, why would it do that? This game sometimes. Uh, okay, and then the type of food that it eats is something, some crab, some crab thing. Crab dispenser. All right, so my staff can keep them fed at least uh, while we're waiting. Um, guests, we hit, and then it went away, and then we hit, and then it went away, and then we hit, and then it went away. Stingray has grown, starfish has grown, stuff has happened. Um, you're good. Now we're just waiting on a little bit of money because I need to expand out this area at least just, just a little bit, like just like to here. Okay, that'll do. Just because that'll give my staff access, you know? So now if I move this sucker to here, if I move all of this to over here, Looks good. Um, move this. There. That's good. And let's get a staff door right here. And get the crab as close as possible. Should be good. Yeah? Are we cool? Are we cool? I hope we're cool. Let's get some of those mackerels. So we need six mackerels. One, two. Oh, come on. Come on. Three at four. Come on. Five. Six. Okay, cool. So they're good on their numbers. Now, what do they need to eat? Cockles. They're good. A lot of the... um. Cold fish don't need like stuff. You know what I mean? Like they don't need um, environmental stuff, which I find interesting. Now, we're gonna risk it with the turbos. We're gonna risk it. I'm not happy about it. Uh, I probably have to buy mussels and stuff, though. I don't think I have access to mussels yet. Uh, mussels. And what did I say that the other ones eat? The mackerels? Cockles, I think. Yeah. Do do do. Bum bum bum. Bum ba da dum bum. Just want easier access for that stuff. Okay, let's get some turbos. And if the turbos are dangerous, I will sell the mackerels off. Okay. So they should otherwise be good though. And once that wolfish gets big, I mean, it's all over, man. All right, and we have hit our prestige goal. And now we are just waiting on our guest count to hit 70, which I think it has floated between quite a bit. Um, so we should get there with this new tank, I would say. While we wait. Is there any new fish that we got access to? No, doesn't look like it. Though we can look through... Those are cold, or those are warm water, those are warm water. Warm water. Warm water, okay. Yep, we're good. Look how big our stingrays are! 
Holy crap, those things got huge! Wow, wow, wow! Wow, they need more, um... Filtration, holy crap! Uh, <laughs> they are like as big as the tank! Hold on, look at that thing! That's awesome! <laughs> wow! I didn't realize that they just keep getting bigger. Holy crap, y'all. All right, let's get some um, prestige stuff up in here. Lantern. Ooh, I like those. And that's the beauty of the, um, the cold tanks. Is because they don't really require environmental stuff so much, you can really fit in a lot of the prestige items. Didn't we unlock, like, the skull and stuff like that? Land of the dead. Just gotta get our guest numbers up. Which I think should happen just naturally because of our increased stuff. You know? Go, go in there. Yeah, go through the tunnel. Alright, um Yeah, improve your feeding, Kiki. Thank you, Kiki. Alright, let's, um, just want to make sure, just in case, it's entirely possible that they'll walk through and then try and walk back out, right? And we want them to go to the right, walk up here, then we want them to walk up this way. Yeah, this has got 88% visibility, which is pretty dang good. Um, we'll give this a little bit of time to grow. What other fish do we have that we haven't represented yet? Or do we have any? Deluxe turlet. Let's get, um popcorn. So, we have deluxe toilets now, so we should replace all of our toilets with deluxe ones. We have three grand. Where did that money come from? Is it just from me sitting around doing nothing for a little bit? I should do that more often. Just kidding. That's my job. <laughs> Hi. Okay. Um, yeah, we're probably using the toilet over here somewhere, huh? Maybe like here? No, we have one right, right across there. What's the range on this? Yeah, we should do one, like, here, I would say. Right there, yeah. So we might want to put another tank somewhere around here. Something, because we're close. We're so close to getting enough guests. And I'm not entirely sure. Oh, there's a person in the toilet. I was like, what is it telling me about? Get out of there. I guess that's why I might need more. Wait. No, there wasn't a person in there. All right, I guess I'll let pause it. That might have just screwed my prestige by not pausing it first. Ah, we were there, yeah, and then it went down. Dang. Why? What's been happening? Is anything dead? No. Okay. Turbo, if you eat my mackerels, I'm going to kick you in the butt. That's for sure. So i got to pay attention to that. So basically, we're going to keep our eyes on this, because here's what's going to happen. If they're a super danger to the mackerels, I'm just going to sell the mackerels. We'll make a smaller tank for the mackerels, because, again, I thought they were Pollux. Um... And we will... What is happening to my friggin' prestige? It keeps dropping significantly. It was at... What is... Why are people leaving? What's going on? Look at this. 50 of 70, 1839. Nothing has died. What's going on? I'm really concerned. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Because we were on a good trajectory. And things just all of a sudden started to go weird. Alright, now it's going up. Oh, you know what it is? This is coming from my talks. Where are my guest numbers going down? How do I increase guest numbers? Because that dropped significantly. 
even though I added more stuff. Like, that's what's confusing me. This type of stuff that I thought you would do in order to increase your guest numbers. Hmm. It's not like there's any more fish that we can really get access to. You're represented, you're represented. You're all represented. You're all represented. Yeah, I mean, we could do stupid coral tank. Um, yeah, I guess I need to do a coral tank. Where do you want to put it? Hmm. Or which of these tanks can be co-opted into a coral tank? You know, like this. Can we add coral here? Would that be doable? Are any y'all bad with corals? Oh, uh, you're bad with stony corals. Wait. Wait. You eat starfish. Crap. It's entirely possible that they've been eating my starfish and that that's been screwing me over. It didn't come up in my info, though. Hmm. What are you bad with? Crustaceans. So as long as the corals I put in here would be stony, or not stony, then we'd be okay. Let's check our corals. Soft. An anemone. And an anemone. And then we have access to some that we can buy. Tubular sponge is a soft. We don't have any stony corals access, I don't think. Mirror antheas we've never used, but they can't go with um, a coral tank. So that's something to consider. We can get some clownfish. We can make a tank for the clownfish, the mirror antheas. What are you? You're a soft coral. Let's see if we can get, um, see if we can get a light rig for this tank first. First thing. Invalid placement. Can't put it on these tanks. You can put them on these tanks. Why can't I put this on this tank? Is it too deep? Maybe. Yeah. So you must need deeper things. Um, do corals take up fish space? I don't think they do, right? So let's look at all these other tanks and see what we can do about them. How are y'all with corals? Bad with stonies. You're fine with them. And that's it. You're, the rest of these are like decorations and things. So if I get myself some power lights. Okay. And then we throw some corals in here. Let's get you some daisy star polyps. And how about... Some bubble tip anemones. Let's see how that does for a little bit. Goes okay. Oh, 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 oh. We need better quality now. And we need zooplankton and artemia. So, that we can do. Um. Zooplankton. Or zooplankton. I know I always say zoa. It's just kind of like this, how my instructors would say that when I was in college. Um, man, those, the, they're so confused, the um, stingrays. They're so big. I feel like this, this stingray on this side can't get over that to hang out with his friend. So that's a shame. Size 40. Gosh, they're big. We can eat size 16 crustaceans. All right, uh, turbos. What are you danger to? Fish size 7. Mackerels are size 8. Nice. Perfect. Okay. Um, we're having trouble feeding them, though. Okay, again, it's like these Belfast tanks are just a pain in the butt to feed. A real pain in the butt. 
I'm gonna do something real quick. I'm gonna, um, just for the purposes of getting us to feed this quicker. We're gonna put this as close to here as possible. But see, the, like these flipping tanks, these Belfast tanks, I don't know what it is. But my people cannot feed them fast enough. Do your business. Wow, wow, whoa, 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 oh, 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 God, oh, God, sorry. Got disconnected. Man, that's, that spooked me. I was like, why is everything dying? Why is everything dying? Why did my moon jellies all of a sudden go? Um, did my starfish die? No. Okay. Everything's good. Everything's fine. Everybody's fed. Okay. We're good over here. Fix it. Um, let's get... Uh, like that. People are getting a little tired over here, apparently. Nope, 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 nope. Sure. A lot of people just get so confused and stuck all the time. So silly. See, it's harder for them to see this tank now, but they will walk by and see it, and this way my people can feed it better. Just makes a lot of sense. All right, how are we doing on all this? We just need to get our guest numbers up. Is, I wish there were a way to, like, advertise or something. You know? Let's get more people in. Um, so how are the corals doing? Corals seem like they're doing fine. How's this tank for corals? How are y'all for corals? You're bad for soft corals, so can't do that. Yeah, close. You are a cold tank, so that won't work, I don't think. How are y'all for corals? I had to put so many rocks in there, that's right. For water quality. But that's fine, I can take them out now. How are y'all for corals? Crustaceans. Otherwise, good. We'll turn this into another coral tank for the other corals that we don't have represented. So... Uh, lights. I'll buy the expensive lights, because why not? Um, here. Let's, um... Just paying attention to my water quality a little bit. I might have to do some splitting, but for the most part it looks fine. So, corals. What do I not have represented in my corals? We've got daisy stars, we've got bubble tips. Let's get some frills. Should be good. Why are they bad? What's wrong? Oh, those are cold ones. Those are cold water ones. Oh, okay. We can put those in one of the other tanks. Okay, that's fine. Um, you are warm water ones. It's a deal. Soft coral. Okay. Should be fine. Um, what other ones? I know we have the, uh, the blue sponges we should have access to. Should be good, I would think. Okay, good. Looks good to me. Nobody in here is a danger to soft coral, so that should be fine. All right, we're cool there. Man, how do I get my guest count up? I mean, I know I can just make, I need to make more exhibits, but I feel like I made this exhibit and it like lowered my guest count, you know? 121 of 225 fish size. Let's throw a couple more turbos in there. And maybe a couple more mackerels. I know it's going to be tricky for my feeding, so I'm really hoping that we've kind of fixed some of this stuff. All right, and then we have a quality problem. We don't have any space on here where I can actually get another item. So I'm going to need to add another pump.
Can the pumps themselves break? I wonder. Okay, that fixed that problem. For now. Um. Yeah, I mean, we get so much out of this. Maybe I should do another talk. Let's get another podium. Let's hire some more people. Uh, and let's set this up as... What should we talk about? Uh, this should be about... We have blue and yellow grouper talk for 405 points. Or wolfish talk for 450. Well, you know what? Let's go for the um, grouper because that's the most that I can get that are science which are useful to me. How are there not headsets? I know I have a supply of headsets. Let's look real quick. Headsets. Let's just put another supply here because we can't. Okay. Uh, man, oh man, we are... It's taking me forever to finish this, and I just need a couple more guests to come in. You know, we're just, like, right on that edge. So, what else can I do to get these last five people in here? Well, we could make that last tank that I was talking about. Where will I put it? Jeez Louise, I don't know. Um, you know what we can do? Okay, here's what we can do. Here's what we can do. We can... Move all this stuff down here. And I can build a wall tank here. And that'll kind of take up this space and that'll fix this. So we're going to move all these amenities a little bit. Something like this. Just going to spread it out a little bit. Something like this. And we'll turn this into a wall tank. Um, and we'll do a staff room over here. So I'm going to work on that. We may hit the number before then, but we're going to do that. And this, man, oh man, my episodes... The number increases how much time it's been taking me for each of these. Oh, and there we go. Right as I'm sitting here like I gotta do this thing. We do it, thank goodness. Because man, oh man, the episode was gonna be a really long one. But luckily, we got it. So, we win. We continue to build it here at Heartcliff, or we can move on to this new space. I don't know if I've played this one yet. Um, I'm ready to take on this mysterious challenge. You continue to build here. Uh, what's the challenge? Take over a small aquarium. The owners have an interesting challenge for you and think you're going to like it. Let's go find out what that's going to be. Myra. Yeah, I haven't been here before. Take charge of Myra Aquarium where the only size that fits is large. Oh, please. If it's only make big tanks, I, I'm experienced. The new owners of Myra... Oh, only big critters. The new owners of Myra Aquarium have decided that its collection of smaller animals just won't cut it anymore. In fact, they've charged you with an ambitious goal. Obtain and house a collection of five awe-inspiring sharks doesn't stop there. So convinced the size is all that matters. They've forbidden you to purchase anything they deem too small. Even small tanks and filters are off the menu. On the plus side, each time you obtain a new shark, it rewards you with a bunch of cash and animals. So this should be your priority. Are you ready to think big? Get to it. Wow. Oh, this is going to be fun. Sharks, y'all. And cuddly fish. Oh, y'all. This will be a fun one. All right. All right, y'all. Well, we're going to go ahead. Uh, well, sure. We'll choose it now. Um, we're going to go ahead and uh, get this on its way. Um, I will be picking right back up here. We'll start at the beginning of this level, but that's gonna be where we're gonna end this episode of Mega Aquarium, y'all. If y'all enjoyed, please be sure to give this video a like, favorite, subscribe to the channel if you're not already. My name has been Price, and I will see y'all next time. <laughs>